Hey there everybody, Matthew Armstrong here on day 74 with this 100 day financial freedom challenge. And I wanted to talk a bit more on, I want to expand on something I mentioned in the, the, previ the previous day's video um, about the difference between wealth and money because this is something that, that's worth looking at that can give you a shift right now, that can give you a distinction that will allow you to become wealthy right now because you know wealth is something who, who you actually are. You are wealth. Your wealth is something who you are uh, and it just takes a realization of it for you to actually um, to, to, for you to actually just bring it into being. It's just, it's just a realization. So in this video, that's what's going to happen. You're going to get this realization that you are already wealthy. Even if you haven't felt it in the past, you can feel it right now because wealth is a feeling. Money is something else. Money is something you have. Uh, wealth is something that you are. Understand? Right? So, you know, to, to give you an example, I talked about it in a, in a video way back, is the time when I, I was down to zero money, where I, I remember going into the supermarket to do a week shopping, and I had 10 euros left, and uh, I, I had to just buy like the most basic things like rice and lentils and things with that 10 euros, and, uh, you know, had the had to think we were just going to have to drink tap water for the week and things like that, which I never do. Um, and the, it wasn't even like there was more money coming at the end of the week. You know, it's not like we had paid jobs or anything. You know, we were trying to build a business at the time, so you know, we, there was just no money coming from anywhere. You know, we, we didn't know where the next money was coming from. But I remember walking out of that supermarket that day uh, with a few things that I had, and just standing there, just realizing that I had actually spent my last pennies, and there was nothing left. And I didn't, I didn't know where the next penny was coming from. I had no idea where that was coming from. Um, and uh, because everything had just pff, fallen flat at the time, it was you know, just one of those times. And being completely okay with it. And feeling gratitude and feeling appreciation. And that was a wealthy feeling. I felt wealthy at that point. I felt wealthy. And I felt completely secure in myself. And completely secure in the future. I didn't have any fear of what was going to happen the next day, the next day, the week after, or anything like that. And uh, it was just a feeling of gratitude and appreciation that, that I had. And it, it didn't matter about the, there was no cash in my pocket or in the bank or coming to me or anything that, was, that I knew of. I, I just knew everything was going to work out and everything was working out because I just felt wealthy, right? So, you know, that, that's the difference between, between money and wealth. Um, sure, it's great to get the money and uh, you know, with the money, money makes things happen. So we can make a lot more things happen in our life with the money. You know, let me tell you, back then I wasn't doing too much. When there was no money, there was, couldn't do anything. There was, couldn't drive the car anywhere. We couldn't go anywhere. We, we just had, had to you know, sit in the apartment and go for walks and didn't want to use up too much energy because that was you know, food that we were, <laughs> we were going to be eating more food if we used up too much energy. And um, so, you know, it, it, was, it was a time where we just didn't really do anything. We didn't socialize. We, um, you know, I, I wasn't really like, training much. Um, like, I couldn't go to any classes because I couldn't pay for the classes. Couldn't drive the car anywhere because there was no fuel to put in the car. Um, so, you know, we didn't do much, but still felt wealthy. Um, so, you know, what money does is money makes things happen. We could, so once the money started coming in, then we could do more things. Then I could go to my classes. Then we could go and go to the you know the cinema. Then we could drive somewhere, go for a nice drive in the hills or whatever. And then we could do more stuff, right? Or, or buy nice things. So money makes things happen, right? And so, but wealth is a different thing. So I wanted to get that distinction with you, so you can be wealthy right now. And by feeling wealthy, then it's much easier then to attract the money into your life by first of all cultivating the feeling and just just realizing that you already are wealthy and just have that, that appreciation that gratitude because you know look at look at the whole world where the average wage for the whole world is something like two dollars a day that's the average wage around the world if you look at all the third world countries two dollars a day you know there's people that live in shacks that have to collect their water from streams and um, just just have no electric or anything and they feel wealthy. They, they have no issues around money. They have no stress around money whatsoever. You know, so it comes down to, it comes down to 
you know, what's your point of view around money? And if you have already got that feeling of wealth, you're going to be able to attract more, more money to you. And when you do, you'll feel good about it. Because it all comes down to, like I said, your point of view around money. And if you have a point of view around money that your know, money is stressed, money is worried, things like that, even when you get it, then you're going to be afraid of losing it. Then you're going to be thinking, what do I spend it on? You know? um, and there's always going to be, or, or how do I get more of it? Um, you know, that, that feeling. And so, so you know, it's, it's much better to actually become wealthy first. And that is something you can do now. That's the thing. It's something you can do now. Don't worry about the money. Be wealthy now. By being wealthy now, then you will attract the money to you. And when you do attract the money to you, you'll feel good about it. You won't feel stressed and you'll make better decisions with that money than if you would if you uh, didn't feel wealthy previous to getting it. Right? Makes sense? Awesome. You know, it's, it's, it's a great distinction to get and I'm, I'm glad you got it. And uh, so then when you do create the money in your life and you do create the financial freedom, um, you're, you're going to uh, feel much better about it. Because I, I know a lot of people who have a lot of money and they're stressed about money. You know, it just brings them more stress. You know, some, a lot of people, the more money they have, the more stressed they are about it because they're afraid of losing it or they don't know what to spend it on, they don't know what to invest in. They're afraid people are going to try and take it off and they're afraid the tax funds are going to take it. You know, so for a lot of people it brings them more stress because of their point of view around it. So if you feel wealthy already and in a state of appreciation and gratitude, which is the key actually, then that's a great thing. So you might want to make a decision right now and click on the link below this video and join our team and then create the financial freedom so you can make more things happen in your life, so you can magnify your life and uh, create an amazing life, um, a life worth living. Right, click on the link below, join our team if you haven't already done so. And if you have, um, you know, when would it be a, now be a good time to take the actions you know you need to take. See you in the next video.